I'm 33 years old. I still live at home with my parents. Go ahead, laugh. I don't care. Let me tell you something. Somebody's got to be there when the cable guy shows up. Okay? If you need a UPS package signed, I'm the man. I'm home all day watering plants, feeding cats, talking to Jehovah Witnesses when they come by. And let me tell you, if they want to talk, they make a very big mistake when they come to my house. Okay? Because I'm ready. I got all day, I'll convert them. <laughs> They'll walk out, Hava, Nagila, Hava. Oh, my dad wants me out real bad. He's like, John, you know, you're 33 years old. When are you going to move out? I said, Dad, I was going to ask you the same question. <laughs> you're 65. Get the hell out of here already. <laughs> then he's like, well, you know, I'm just concerned. I mean, what are you going to do when we're dead? Well, first thing I'm going to do is move into the big bedroom. Then I'm going to take the plastic off the furniture. <laughs> so he's telling me how hard he works. Who cares? I told him, I said, Dad, I didn't ask to be born, all right? On that magical night I was conceived, you should have wrapped that rascal. Because <laughs> I fought my way past millions of other sperm, up the ovum, impregnated that egg, and that is the last hard job I am ever doing. <laughs> I'm still tired. <laughs> I beat a million people in a race, now I gotta shovel the walk? Screw you.